going on. I go by the name of L.A. Wins, and I'm here to vent. You know how you wanted to come out? That can be frustrating. Mm -hmm. Very frustrating. Oh, all right. But I mean, like, even, like, um, like, to, like, us, like, directors and shit like that. Mm -hmm. Like, the shit we notice, other people don't notice, right? Mm -hmm. You know, and stuff like that. You know, like, editing or this chop was a little rough or, mm -hmm. you know, this, the lighting was kind of low. Right. Like, things like that, right? Um, like... How do you how do you ever get to the point of wanting to release something at that point? Like, cause I like I used to have trouble with that, and then like I just started doing like the exact opposite, just like just like releasing things and letting people like start criticizing. You understand what I'm saying? Cause I think I started realizing I wasn't getting my shit out at all because I was such a perfectionist. How do you? Me, mm. luckily, I don't have that issue, mm. but I know. I have people in my circle that does have that issue. Mm -hmm. Where I'm very big on taking your time, mm -hmm. making sure your quality is this way, making sure, you know, you're not rushing it. Mm -hmm. Making you know, just staying on top of shit like that. And like I said, my partner, <laughs> mm -hmm. like he's a like he's the worst when it comes <laughs> to being a perfectionist. Cause like I said, we have a talk about one thing, mm -hmm. and then he'll have a whole new idea. Mm -hmm. For the next set of days, <laughs> a few new ideas. Yeah. For the same, like, bro. I understand, you know, you want your shit to come out how you want it to come out, but at mm. some point, when you're releasing projects or product, mm. when you release it, it's out of your hands. So it's not really for you to critique anyway. Mm. That's how I look at it. It's for everyone else to judge. Yeah. You could think your shit looked the best. And people, but it ain't. Yeah. It ain't. It ain't about you. You know, it ain't about you at the end of the day. Yeah. So you do the best you could do. You really, you know, you you you, you release it to the world, mm -hmm. and however you receive, it's just what it is. You just do you continue to try to do better each time. How often does that happen to you? Like um, you would say, like, damn. Uh, I really like this. Like working with artists, and they um think they'll try to tell you like, no, nah, this isn't it or something. Like oh, that. I get that all the time. <laughs> I get that often. <laughs> but it's all about trusting, letting them trust your judgment, mm -hmm. off of, based off of what you what you have shown already. Yeah. You know. Okay, from you, you let your yeah. resume speak for itself. Yeah. So mm -hmm. they know my work. Mm -hmm. So I don't really have to say much. I don't have to. I don't. I don't have to try to. I, I don't have to try to. So what I'm looking for. Persuade them that you, like this is you know. I don't. I don't have to beat that into their head like. This is what I shot. This is something similar that you're looking. We can do this. We can go with that. And if that reference is there. It's your boy LA Wins, and I just vented, so be sure to like, subscribe, and comment.